Greetings once again, Earthman, Origami's Living Soil, child of God and proud of it. And uh, bringing you some good news here from the soil. Um, here we got, um, I'm making IMO1, and here we go, IMO1. It's right there. Um, I took some cooked rice, put it in my IMO chamber, I like to call it. Just covered it with a lid, and there you go. About a week later or less, um, you got this. A whole bunch of beautiful bacteria and fungi growth going on there. And um, I told you my IMO chamber is so rich. Look at um, I didn't put anything in it. It just happened. That's how alive this soil is. Um, and, yeah, it's pretty incredible. I'm going to throw some worms in here. I had some worms in here before. I need to put some more worms in here and start feeding them. You know, just all sorts of living organisms. But um, what I'm going to do with this now is I'm going to mix it with this brown sugar. And then I'm going to store it in a container. And I'll show you what it looks like after. Uh, I'll do a follow video what it looks like after I'm done. But basically you mix this with that. And just get a good mixture, and that's your IMO2. And then from there, you can make IMO3 and 4 and go on and so forth. Um, this is awesome stuff, concentrated bacteria. And there's lots of different ways to use it for your garden um, and for your plants. Um, so there you go, IMO2 here. So I'm going to take that and mix it with the brown sugar, about equals amounts, as you can see. And then I'll, and this will store for up to a year or two, just like the EM1 that I showed you in a prior video. So that's it. May God bless you and um, have a great day.